Okay, we have a lot of things to talk about for this fictional Friday. But first, I'll start off with a quote because it's good. This comes from The Eminence and Shadow. I don't think I did a review about it, but it's decent. It's a shorter, it's not as in-depth, and it's kind of like one of those light novels where characters overpowered, so you're going to have to have some side things, make it funny, do different situations, da 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 I might do a few full review on there later. Most likely I will. I just don't know when. But this is where it comes from. In the shadows of our peaceful lives, the world is ever changing. If we stand still, we're sure to be left behind. That's from Alexia, one of the characters in that series. Now, I want to use that because there's a lot of stuff and we need to keep up to date. Because if we don't, we'll get left behind. And to start off with... Oh, we'll do the worst news first. Worst news. Try it out for Spoken. I was kind of, I wasn't excited about the game. I'm talking about the demo because the demo was released. I don't think the full game's out yet. So I was interested in it. I was a little intrigued. So I saw the demo and I tried out the demo. I didn't like it. I'm going to tell you why I didn't like it and why I'm not going to get the game. I'm not going to be all like friendly. Oh, if you're this and that, you might like it, blah, blah, blah. You can choose it all. I know why I don't like it. Number one. Now, this might be a polish sense, but when I use my blade, I'm probably because I don't know how it works. I like the blade thing. One thing they've turned to like some, they have one thing like a scattershot thing. So it's supposed to be some type of gun, magic mix, da, da, da. But with the blade thing i use it and then all of a sudden it goes back to another weapon thing there might be mechanic situation i need to fix that and tweak that or it might be some underlying thing like i ran out of magic so it i can't use that so it automatically switch i don't know and then it's like it's kind of weird it gives me some final fantasy vibes i don't i haven't played final fantasy 15 but it's, i'm like picking up some crafting material I did, did like the opening music. The opening music was good, so that's good. Um, I, female protagonist, that's kind of different uh, because there's not a lot of good video games with a female protagonist. Honestly, I can't think of... I haven't played Horizon Zero Dawn. I hear it's very good, so I will play it eventually. But right now, I haven't played any game. Last of Us Part 2... I've heard that was really good too. I would have to play it. I really never got really into Tomb Raider, so I can't really say. But I'm pretty sure there are some good games out there. But for this one, don't like it. And then the magic, it's just all this stuff. Just all this stuff there. The skill tree and the tree. I don't I don't like it. I just don't like it. So I deleted the demo. I will not be paying for it. There's more money to be used in other games. And I really prefer strategy if you see my Let's Plays and all that. God of War is different. God of War is like tier, it's 10 out of 10. The story mode, the gameplay, everything. It's a classic. It's just amazing. Like that's game of the year. Like, and it's not, and so it's not a strategy game, but I lean towards role playing strategy games. So that's the bad news. You can play it if you want to. They have a demo on PlayStation. And I think I played on PlayStation 5. So you might be able to play it on PlayStation 4. I don't know. I don't care. Now we're done with that. Next news. Elder Scrolls Legends. I think we have about two weeks left. I don't know. It depends. We're, we just started Act 2. So we have two or three weeks left of material for that. But I came across another Elder Scrolls game for the iPad. Because that's what I've been playing on. It's Elder Scrolls Blades. And then I hear it's good. We'll try it out after Elder Scrolls Legends. I really was planning on transitioning out of the mobile spaces because there's not any good mobile games right now. Well, only mobile games. I know I can play Civ 6 on my iPad or I can play it on my computer. So that's that for Elder Scrolls Legends. It's going well. Clockwork City, we finally made it into Clockwork City instead of doing all this stuff to get into it. We're actually in there now. So that's Clockwork City. And that's Elder Scrolls Legends. I don't have a script, so I'm just saying it. God of War. We're talking about God of War. We are on the Moose Baham Trials. We finally finished the first set of the areas. And then at the end, there was this Valkyrie. Valkyries, 
Don't underestimate Valkyries. Valkyries are just... I have a newfound respect. Gondol, I remember you. That's her name. That's the name of the Valkyrie. Super strong. I played on the easiest difficulty. It might be just because I'm lame and not trash. Or it's because they're really powerful. But then they reset it. So, like, there's a different stage. Which makes sense because I'm like... They really didn't give me enough resources to upgrade all the items to completion. I do need to check before I keep on going through this. In fact, I will check right now. And I'm gonna I'm gonna pull a little looking of how many levels to the most small time trial. Could I really? Could I, we're gonna go back over. We're gonna go over to the most time trials. Once you complete all six of the combat trials, you will unlock a nowhere near chest in the central most bottom area, which contains a chaos plane, which upgrades Kados's Blades of Chaos. Spell okay, most bomb crystal trial guy. So, ring out final challenge trials, rampage, kill fuse, endurance onslaught. So, we're going to do that for the next session. We're going to play it again because this time we get the keys. I don't think it's going to be one of those radiant things. Because I hate radiant quests where it just never ends. Like one of the Skyrim things. Well, with Skyrim, with the Thieves Guild radiant quest, when you play them, then you can eventually get to the point where you bring the Thieves Guild back to their former world. Like they're random but if you get to a certain amount of quest in a hold, then you're basically building up. So it seems random, but it has a purpose. It ends. Uh, and then there are some quests in Skyrim where, like, the Toph Deer's a limit. Like, he keeps on losing it. And that's a rating. It's stupid. I hate it. Maybe he's forgetful, but... I need to find some mods when I go back to that because I, I would hate that stupid Radiant Quest where I have to keep on finding it. Now, I understand that the Radiant Quests are good and as an end. Like, maybe if he loses it three times and you find it the third time, just break it or something like that. So, that's for that. Now, it's time for the good stuff. Oh, we have to talk about Civ, Civ 6. But it's kind of in, uh, interrelated. Civ 6 and the good stuff. The good stuff is, they finally really revealed the M2 Max MacBook Pro. So it's time to upgrade. And after we upgrade, then we won't have all those horrible problems with Civ 6 anymore. We, it will be faster. I wonder how fast. Like, snap your finger fast. We can finally play with all these civilizations and we can have a really good game. And it'll speed up things well be able to play the games quicker because we want to wait as long for it to do all the processing and stuff so we can go to the next turn which will work we won't have it for this week wait when is it coming out 24 25th so hopefully we'll have it next week or the week after i don't know we'll see i'll make a video about it but that's all that i have a little update so i hope you like the quote and now I have to look up the most bottom trial. But I want to keep on doing it if it's not going to end. So thank you for helping me find something to do. Like this video for the YouTube algorithm so people can know that things are happening in the world. Uh, subscribe for future videos and all the gameplay I discussed. And we're going to start incorporating different things. Of course, it's not going to turn into a tech review channel, but if it helps playing games and proves the life of us gamers, then I feel like it's important to discuss. Oh, Age of Wonders 4 is coming up. So I might do that because I loved Age of Wonders 3. I did watch a video of Age of Wonders 4. I might start doing some reactions too. Of course, they say niche down, but really, this channel is time to have some fun and not get niche down, but. I already have all these other channels and stuff like that. I can't be niching down and make, oh, this is a gaming reaction channel. I already, you know how much, I had to use a second number, a Google number, to, like, verify the channels because I'm doing some other stuff for what my compatriots are. So, yeah. 
this is gonna cover everything gaming, anime, it's gonna be all of that stuff. That's what this channel is gonna be about. So, we're not niching down. We're not only playing God of War games, but we are gonna play some God of War. We're not gonna play, oh yeah, we're gonna play campaign court, uh, Call of Duty. We're not playing multiplayer Call of Duty because I'm trash at it. We'll play, oh, I can't play zombies either. At least I can play these zombies on PS5, and I have my own for two on PS5. So I'll have to wait until a new Call of Duty comes out and then play on there and record, stream, and do some stuff. We can do some stuff when we upgrade computers. We're gonna do some stuff. But until then, thanks for watching. Subscribe for the content because it's about to get good. And now we stop.